Hey Team Iron Strike, this is Greg Fontaine, um, giving you a deck profile on Ancient Gears. Um, so Ancient Gears are pretty darn good in, um, before the Link format came out, so I'll give you a deck profile on that. Um, starting with three Ancient Gear Golems. Um, it's the boss monster in my deck. Um, if it declares an attack, um, it does piercing damage, and my opponent cannot activate any spell or trap cards during the damage step. I play two Ancient Gear Beasts. Um, it is a monster, so if it declares an, if it declares dam, so during the damage step, if my opponent activates, I uh, cannot activate any spell or trap cards until the end of the damage step. Also, it can negate any effects that my opponent, that the monster is this, that battles that monster and destroys it before damage cut, with, the, with this damage cut in, including um, damage calculation from the graveyard, in the graveyard. So my opponent can't activate any effects during the damage step or spell and traps. I play one Ancient Gear Engineer as 1500 tech, 1500 defense. Um, it can negate any spell, it can negate trap cards. Um, and if I do destroy that trap card, if this card attacks my opponent, my opponent can also not activate any spell or trap cards uh, during, the, during the end of the damage step, cannot activate anything. At the end of the damage step, if this attack target the spell trap card and my opponent controls and destroy it. I play a play set of uh, Ancient Gear Soldier. It has 1300 attack, 1300 defense. Uh, when closing a uh, battle, it, my opponent cannot activate any spell or trap cards. I play one Ancient Gear Cannon. Uh, Ancient Gear Cannon, if you tribute it, it will. Um, you dish out 500 points of damage, and opponent cannot activate any. Sp um, another player can activate spell. Or cannot activate trap cards until the end of the damage. Until after that, I play a play a set of three ancient gears. Ancient gears is a monster. So if I were to activate a, sp if I wanted to play a magnet circle level two. I can special summon an ancient gear. Ancient gear can special summon another ancient gear, and another ancient gear can special summon another ancient gear, and I can tribute them for ancient gear golem. I play two Trojan horses. Um, uh, Trojan horse counts as two tributes for a earth type monster. I play one MSC of the infinity. Um, each time it destroys a monster by battle, um, it gets bigger. It's like, um, a monster, this monster can gain very much more powerful for unknown reasons. Uh, on to spells, I play two Ancient Gear Castles. This gains 300, so all Ancient Gear monsters gain 300 attack for each time a monster is on the field. Also, contribute a... Um, as long as it gains counters, it can, um, so when it gains two counters, you can tribute it to get an Ancient Gear Golem. I play two Ancient Gear Tanks. It gives my Ancient, one of my Ancient Gear Monsters 600 attack, and if it's destroyed, it inflicts 600 damage. I play two Ancient Gear Workshops. Um, so, yeah. I play two Ancient Gear Drills, one of them is a proxy. Um, ancient Gear Drill is, let's say I wanted to play, discard one card. Um, let's say I wanted to add ancient gear, another Ancient Gear Drill face down. Gotta wait one whole turn before activating it. Uh, or, or limit removal. So I play one Spell Gear. Uh, spell gear is by tri by tributing three ancient gear monsters that I control in the field. I can tribute them to get 
in, in, three ancient gear golems to the field. I play one ancient gear fist. Uh, ancient gear fist is when it equips to a monster, um, it could without after damage calculation. During the end of the damage calculation, you can destroy a monster. Uh, I play one Ancient Gear Factory. So let's say I wanted to bring, let's say I had an Ancient Gear Golem in my hand. I can reveal it to my opponent and uh, banish uh, Ancient Gear monsters with the whole double the levels of the Ancient Gear Golem. I play one Ancient Gear Explosive. Um, I, w I usually beat my opponent with that, so I'm, us I'm using a proxy to back it up. Um, so I play one Heavy Storm. Destroys two spells, can destroy all spells and traps off the field. I play one Magnet Circle level two. One Limit Removal. Doubles, explodes itself. One Confiscation. Confiscation, what it does is, by paying a thousand my life points, I get to look at my opponent's hand, and select one card and discard it to the grave. One premature burial. One graceful charity. One polymerization. One pot of greed. Um, what pot of greed is is what? Draw two cards. On to traps. I play four cards. Is, is uh, four trap cards. Is two zero gravities. What that does is change all bow positions of monsters to defense and vice versa. I play two damage condensers. Uh, damage condensers does when if I were to take bow damage, I could discard one card. Especially some ancient gear going for my. De from a uh, deck equal to, let's say, they dealt 3,000 points of damage to me, I can activate Damage Condenser, discard one card, special summon from my, um, from my deck with Ancient Gear Golem, for an example. Comes out. Uh, for on the fusions, I'll play one Ancient Gear Golem. What Ancient Gear Golem does... Ultimate Ancient Gear Golem, what he does is, my punk can't activate anything anything towards him. Ancient Gear, Ultimate Ancient Gear Golem. So what he does is, I can special, um, if he were to be destroyed by battle or by card effects, I could special, special summon, let's say, an Ancient Gear Golem from my, from my uh, graveyard and special summon him straight to the field. So, it, um, so that is my deck profile of Ancient Gears. Um, I hope everyone likes this, and please subscribe to my channel uh, of Team Ar Iron Strike. Um, please, please subscribe and press the thumbs up button. Thank you.